Alright students, now we come back again to our English lesson. Baiklah anak-anak, kita akan kembali lagi ke pelajaran bahasa Inggris. Everyone may open the textbook. Kalian boleh buka buku paket. It is on page 34. Halaman 34. Okay, it is about abilities, kemampuan. Now you see, I will read for you. Number one. Tania can play a piano. Tania bisa bermain piano. Budi and Peter can ride a bike. Budi dan Peter bisa mengendarai. Next, Budi cannot play chess. Budi tidak bisa bermain catur. The last one, a child cannot drive a car. Seorang anak-anak tidak bisa mengemudi mobil. Okay, from here, we can know that can is used to show the ability to do something. Jadi, can itu digunakan untuk menunjukkan kemampuan untuk melakukan sesuatu. Contohnya, for example, ya, the boy can ride a horse. Anak laki-laki bisa mengendarai kuda. Can't or cannot is used to show the inability to do something. The can ataupun cannot itu digunakan untuk menunjukkan ketidakmampuan untuk melakukan sesuatu. For example, he cannot climb a mountain. Dia tidak bisa Mendaki gunung. Okay, now everyone pay uh, pay attention. You may open the book page thirty five. Boleh buka buku paket halaman tiga puluh lima. Okay, number one, my mother cook. You can write become my mother can cook. A bird fly. Burung terbang. Burung bisa terbang. Can ya. So a bird can fly. Number three, a singer can sing. A horse can run. Number five, Andy can drive. Okay, for this one, all you use can ya. Untuk bagian ini, semuanya kita gunakan can, bisa. Okay, now the below one. Brandon not pain. Brandon cannot pain. This part all you use cannot. A snake cannot fly. Father cannot swim. A turtle cannot run. My sister cannot read. Okay, bagian ini semua kita gunakan tidak bisa cannot. Okay. After this, later Miss will give you some exercises. Miss akan kasih kalian latihan. You write in your exercise book. Tulis di buku latihan. Only 10 numbers. Hanya 10 soal saja. And beside that, you have to write something in your notebook. Selain ini, kamu harus menulis catatan ya. Okay, that's all for today. Miss, we'll see you back next week. Bye-bye, everyone.